Hey guys, it's me, Christy Lee, and I told you that I had two boxes coming from Influencer. They're here, and I'm going to open them up for you. So the first one is just a small rectangular box. This is the one from Head and Shoulders. So let's see what they sent. It's an easy one to open. is a full size bottle of Head and Shoulders 2-in-1 Green Apple. That's kind of cool. I've never smelt Green Apple Head and Shoulders before. Let's try to get some of this light down. That's not working. Anyway. Okay. Let's see what this smells like. I just washed my hair last night, so I won't get to try it tonight, but in a few days, I will. It smells like green apple stuff. 8.45 fluid ounces for uh, dandruff shampoo and conditioner. Very cool. Very cool. All right. And of course it comes with the little card, the kind of card you get for every mission. Um, this just shows you the different, I guess the different types that they have right now. Um, they have something called Instant Fresh Collection, a unique formula with cucumber and mint essence invigorates hair and scalp on contact. That would have been pretty cool to try. That's this one down here. Nourishing Hair and Scalp Collection, um, Head and Shoulders with Old Spice for Men. Alright, so now that that's here, I just have to check that in. I'm trying to cut down on the hot spotness on my face. Not working. Okay, on to the next thing. Hair's all over the place. Here is the big one. This is the biggest box box I think I've ever received. So let's open this one up. I was a little worried about these boxes because I've had some thievery in my mail. Sooner or later, I'm going to need to get a P.O. box. Oh, I'm so excited about this because I actually have some of this. And it is my new favorite deodorant. I use it every day and it's awesome. Secret Outlast Extend in completely clean scent. I wish you could make videos where you guys can smell it because it smells really good and it the, the scent stays with you all day long. My new favorite deodorant. I'm so excited they sent me this. I won't have to buy one when my other one runs out. Yay. All right. Next we have. I'm not sure what this is. Um, Clairol Nice and Easy CC Plus Color Seal Conditioner for Radiant Reds. Intense Conditioner for Colored Hair. This is a, I guess a full size tube of whatever this is. I remember them asking me something about whether or not I color my hair and me saying yes and that it was a red, because it is kind of a red-ish, but most of my color has worn out. Um, the, this hair color I actually got from Crowtap and unfortunately I did my review before I had the chance to actually, I guess, fully experience it because I've had it in for maybe three weeks, a month now, and it's it's all but gone. I mean, you can see the brown coming back through. The first uh, week after I dyed it, my hair was almost purple. So this is, I guess, to help keep the color in your hair, and it smells really good really nice. I like that. So I'm going to try this next time I wash. 
All right. And then we have Olay Regenerist Advanced Anti-Aging Micro Sculpting Cream with Sunscreen Broad Spectrum SPF 30 Moisturizer. That's a mouthful. Very nice. This almost looks like the um, L'Oreal Revitalift line that I received several months ago that I'm still using. It's got the same kind of colors. Very cool. I don't know why I'm smelling that. It's probably not going to have a smell. All right, set that up there. And the next thing, oh my God, Vada, <laughs> is Herbal Essences Naked with 0% percent paraben something, something. Shampoo and conditioner. <laughs> what are you doing? The two full-size bottles of that. Um... I'm guessing that it's strawberry. Where did you go? <laughs> strawberry, but they're like white strawberries. <laughs> Herbal essence naked. <laughs> you see my color? It's like glaring at me. <clears throat> have you ever seen a white strawberry? Mm -hmm. Me either. Actually, I think I have, but I don't know what it is. It doesn't really smell strawberry-ish. It smells more minty, strawberry flavor. Something. Anyway, I say anyway, Emma. Two full-size bottles here. We won't have to buy shampoo or conditioner for a long time. All right, and what is the card that came in it? Okay, so here's the card that gives me information on everything I got and apparently the price of some of the stuff. <laughs> My hair is just like... Anyway, um, I feel like I'm blinding you guys. I'll just hold this right here so you're not so blind. Can you even hear me? All right, so the CC Color Seal Conditioner from Clairol is $3.49 in stores. I'll let you guys know how that turned out. Secret Outlast Extend is $4.29 in stores. I have a kitten climbing the back of my boot. Okay, okay, hey, hey, that's not a scratching post. The Olay Regenerous Micro Sculpting Cream with SPF 30 is $25 to $33.99 in stores and the herbal essence make the clean and refresh collection it does not tell me how much it is in stores so yeah that's everything oh i guess i could have taken a look at uh this picture on influencer and i might have known what i was getting but maybe not i don't know all right isn't that exciting um I guess since this stuff was from Influencer, Inf Influencer, I don't know why I always say Influencer, um, I guess I should tell you guys a little bit more about that. Um, I want to say it's similar to CrowdTap, but it's not, so, um, Influencer is it's kind of like a place that you can go, um, well, first of all, to review items or products that you've tried. If there is a product that you're interested in or thinking about trying, it's a great place to go and you find the product, you can ask questions on it, and other members who have already tried it will answer your questions for you so that you can get a little more information before you buy it. Um, for example, I was thinking of trying an eyeshadow primer, but I didn't really see the point in it, so I asked, and I got some really good feedback, which led me to buy some eyeshadow primer. Um, 
so uh, what I did when I first started influencers, I basically went through my house and anything that I had laying around, like deodorant, toothpaste, snacks, anything, I went on there and I reviewed the product. Um, and at any given point, influence influencer is going to send you emails. They're called uh, pre pre box box surveys, maybe. Uh, and you answer a few questions, and if you're a match for the upcoming box box, you will get another notification saying that you did it. I mean that you got it. <laughs> Except for like in this instance, I knew I was getting the head and shoulders because I took the um, survey and within 24 hours got a response that I was I was going to be getting it. And then several days later, I went on my dashboard to check out when this mission or campaign rather would be due and saw that I had another Vox Box coming and I never heard a thing about it. And that was the beauty Vox Box. Um, sponsored by P&G if you didn't see that so P&G uh, makes all those products and they sent out a box box to me very cool so with in influencer it's all based on your social rating um, because it has to do with your they call it your social reach so if you're like me and you have a YouTube channel with a couple hundred followers and I started Influencer when I had 20 subscribers. Actually, it might even have been less than that, and I was still receiving box boxes back then. Now I'm up to almost 700 subscribers. Thank you all very much, by the way. Um, and so I seem to be getting uh, boxes more frequently, I guess, and maybe even some better stuff. Um, so you're going to link your YouTube if you have one, you're going to link your Twitter, your Facebook. Uh, they just recently added, um, I think Foursquare and Tumblr maybe, Vine, I think. They added a few different other social networking platforms, uh, none of which I use. So my reach right now is up to 1500 and something. I think when I started out it was like 300. So I'm coming along. Um, you don't need a referral link or anything uh, to join. You just go on there and create an account, start linking your stuff, answer some questions, and expect box boxes. I guess that's it for this one. Um, I would love to show you guys everything I received from this one. Let me see if I can get it set up where you can see it all. How are you guys liking my new setup? I moved so that I don't have that ugly um, window unit glaring at you from behind me. Um, I've got my wall that's got a, a canvas I painted. The top one is a painting my youngest son did and the bottom one is a painting that one of my twins did. So that's my backdrop now. <clears throat> okay, so I guess this is what I got all together right here. I'm going to flip the camera around so you guys can see it after I shake you all around a bit. Yay! Lots of cool stuff. Alright, I'm going to let you guys go. Thank you for watching. Um, I hate doing this, but they keep recommending that I do it. Please like, comment, and share this video if you enjoyed it. <laughs> If you need any help getting started on these sites that I've been telling you about, please feel free to comment or PM me and I will help you out in any way that I can, alright? Thanks for watching guys and I will see you next time. Bye!